William Penn, the 14th of October 1644 to 30 July 1718, was once an English Quaker, entrepreneur, truth seeker and founder of Philadelphia. Penn was once an influential parent in the early American colonies, supporting to promote thoughts of democracy, non-secular tolerance and the thinking of uniting the American colonies. Early life William Penn was once born to a rich Anglican family. The son of Admiral Sir William Penn. He used to be born in Tower Hill, London in 1644, however. After a childhood episode of smallpox, where he misplaced all his hair, the household moved to a small United States property in Essex. He studied at Chigwell School and later Christ Church. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, share and subscribe. Like it. Oxford. Penn's father had inherited a massive property in Ireland for his carrier to Cromwell. Throughout his conquest of Ireland, when William Penn used to be 15, the household fell out of favor with Cromwell and they moved to this property in Ireland. However, a year later, Cromwell died. And, as an admiral in the navy, Penn's father was once instrumental in efficaciously bringing returned the exiled Charles II by means of boat return to England. The king used to be very grateful for Penn's carrier and felt indebted to his family. Whilst dwelling in Ireland, William Penn used to be moved by using a speech through the Quaker, Thomas Loe, and this wakened an activity in the nonconformist religion. Later, he remarked how this pastime was once accompanied by means of mystical experiences. The Lord visited me and gave me divine impressions of himself. The essence of the Quaker faith was once to see no middleman between man and God. As a result, Quakers would no longer swear an oath of allegiance to both king or parliament. In the upheaval of the English Civil War, this used to be radical dissent. After returning to England, Penn enrolled at Christ Church, Oxford University, the place he grew to be extra worried in discussing dissenting non-secular thoughts with like-minded academics. When the Oxford theologian, John Owen used to be fired and censured for his dissenting views, the younger Penn stood with the aid of the dean and endured to companion with him. As an end result of his stance, the university find him, and, concerned about the injury to the household reputation, his father eliminated him from Oxford and later dispatched him to Paris, hoping he would regulate his radical views. But, in Paris, he received in addition non-secular thoughts from Moise Amiro, a Christian humanist, who Penn liked. On returning to London, Penn studied law, however London was once quickly ravaged via the plague and then the great fire of london due to the fact of the plague penn briefly back to ireland his experiences helped domesticate a deeper conviction in his quaker views and he grew to be pleasant with george fox and different distinguished quakers it was once a tough time to be a quaker due to the fact there had been legal guidelines designed to discriminate in opposition to the religion their conferences had been regularly damaged up and individuals fined or jailed for refusing to pledge the oath of allegiance. Penn's father pleaded in useless to flip his son away from his dissenting faith, however he used to be unsuccessful due to his occupation of the Quaker trust and his virulent pamphlets advertising Quakerism and criticizing different Christian faiths. He used to be dispatched to jail for brief intervals of time. On one event in 1870, Penn used to be arrested for conserving a non-Anglican non-secular meeting. The judge, the Lord Mayor of London, oversaw the trial and refused to enable Penn even to see the prices laid in opposition to him. As a result, the jury lower back a verdict of not guilty. But, regardless of the verdict of not guilty, the Chews jailed Penn for contempt of court. He additionally put the jury in jail, asking them to reconsider. This led the jury contributors to attraction and reap the proper to be free 
From the manipulative judges, a necessary priority of habeas corpus and the notion of jury. Nullification, Penn was once released, however spent quite a few intervals of time in jail. In 1669, even as in jail, he wrote No Cross, No Crown, 1669. It used to be a basic of jail literature. Increasing Quaker philosophy in an enticing way. He additionally wrote an introduction to Introduction to the Journal of George Fox. In these writings, he talked about the virtues of early primitive Christianity, the place the emphasis used to be on direct communion with God. Earlier than the set-up church buildings received extra power. Religion itself is nothing else. However love to God and man. He that lives in love lives in God, says the beloved disciple, and to be certain a man can stay know the place better. Fruits of Solitude, 1682, Penn grew to be one of the main proponents of Quakerism and used to be defiant about the danger of jail, no longer conserving lower back on his criticism of spiritual and political orthodoxy to supply a strong exposition of his non-secular ideals. My jail shall be my grave earlier than I will budge a jot, for I owe my sense of right and wrong to no mortal man. Pen, after being imprisoned in the Tower of London for expressing his thoughts on non-secular freedoms, 1668, without his household's prestige, Pen may also have suffered greater stringent punishments. But, given the Local weather of hostility to Quakers, Penn made plans to go away for the New World in North America, the place there used to be a recognition for higher spiritual tolerance. Founding of Pennsylvania in 1677, with a team of different Quaker entrepreneurs, Penn commenced to lay the foundations for a new agreement in New Jersey. Penn was once nevertheless in England, however he enthusiastically drafted a constitution of liberties for the settlement. Drawing on his very own experiences, he assured free and truthful trials by using jury, freedom of religion, free and honest elections and freedom from unjust imprisonment. No men hath power or authority to rule over men's consciences in religious matters. DNB, 434, William underscore Penn underscore at underscore 22 underscore William Penn. At 22 the agreement used to be helped by way of a legacy from Charles II, who felt he had a massive debt with Penn's father and was once inclined to supply a remarkably beneficent location. For these political and spiritual dissenters, Charles perhaps noticed this as a suitable way to be rid of troublemakers. The new agreement used to be time period Penn, after Sir William Penn, and Sylvania, Woods, with this royal endowment and profitable bargaining, Penn received in place of 45,000 acres of land the Mannequin City carried out freedom of worship, for these who believed in God, and the pioneering legal guidelines of free elections, honest trials and a separation of political powers. Ideas in the Pennsylvania frame of government, 1682, would structure the groundwork of the American Constitution. Penn's philosophy for separation of powers was once primarily based on his wish to limit the scope for one man's tyrannical rule. He stated the charter. Thanks for watching, like, comment, share and subscribe like it or would go away him or future guys with no electricity of doing mischief that the will of one man may additionally now not preclude the precise of a total country the new settlement which assured spiritual tolerance attracted settlers from all different europe frequently composed of non-secular minorities such as quakers french huguenots french protestants amish and mennonites in 1682, Penn left England, looking for to assist construct the metropolis he deliberate for on paper. He was once an instrumental parent in enforcing his theoretical coverage ideas. Penn mixed each idealism, bordering on utopianism, however additionally 
sensible realism, where indispensable he sought a sensible solution, while nonetheless attempting to protecting his faith in liberal government. Penn carried out an extra-liberal justice system. Capital punishment was once solely applied for two crimes of homicide and treason, there had been 200 capital offenses in England. He additionally sought to make prisons modern locations of rehabilitation alternatively than locations of punishment. Quakers have been additionally main figures in the cure of intellectual illness, decriminalizing it through the vast provision of education, Pennsylvania blossomed as a center of commerce and science. Penn additionally carried out strict, puritanical, legal guidelines on immoral activities, banning cockfighting, gambling, and placing legal guidelines on drunkenness, swearing and lying. Accord with native Indians as nicely as the politics of the metropolis of Pennsylvania, he additionally explored the indoors of New Jersey, befriending neighborhood Indian tribes, especially the Lenny Lenape Indians. He learned the language and dialects of the foremost tribes, enabling higher conversation and supporting to foster accurate relations. Penn ensured the Indian tribes have been pretty paid for land, and it was once held up as an instance of correct members of the family between settlers and native Indians. I have superb love and regard towards you, and I want to win and achieve your love and friendship by using a form just and peaceful life, and the human beings I ship are of the equal mind, and shall in all matters behave themselves accordingly. Letter to the Lenape Nation, the 18th of October 1681, returning to England after the succession of his friend, the Duke of York. Who grew to be King James, Penn used his royal have an effect on to obtain the launch of prisoners of sense of right and wrong such as Quakers and John Locke. The later Act of Toleration, 1689, helped legalize the concept of spiritual tolerance that Penn and others had argued for. Penn wrote, some visionary documents, including, an essay towards the present and future peace of Europe. 1693, which envisaged a global employer to assist mitigate towards European conflict. In 1699, he proposed the thinking of a federation of all the American colonies to promote realistic options and precise relationships. This used to be an embryonic thinking at the back of the future. United States of America. He additionally proposed the concept of a federation of European states which is frequently viewed as the forerunner of the European Union. Later years in 1701, Penn was once pressured to return to England, due to economic problems. His economic advisor Philip Ford had defrauded him out of a considerable sum, leaving him in dire economic straits. Ford had taken gain of Penn's aversion to element, inclined to signal papers besides analyzing Penn tried to Sue Ford in court, however was once generally unsuccessful in rescuing his economic situation, and he even spent time in debtor's penitentiary for financial disaster in 1702. Struggling with monetary problems, he suffered a stroke in 1712, which left him paralyzed. His closing years have been now not completely satisfied ones. He died in 1718 in Ruscombe, Berkshire. Family Penn. Married twice. His first spouse Julielma's Maria's posthumous Springitz died in 1696. He remarried, two years after her demise to Hannah Margaret Callowhill, who was once simply 25 when he used to be 50. He had eight youth from his first marriage and eight youngsters from his 2D marriage. Thanks for watching, like, comment, share and subscribe. Like it.